It's more like it. I'm feeling better, Curtis. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, great. And since you're feeling better, I'd like to ask you something. Why are you dressed like a tree? <laughs> this is for a school plan, and I'm supposed to say some stuff about trees. Oh, could you do it for us right now? Oh, yeah, please. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Behold the tree, it stands so tall. A home to some, a gift to all. It gives us food, it gives us wood. Brings beauty to a neighborhood. With limbs outstretched in majesty, in crown of green, behold the tree. <laughs> now that's the funniest thing I ever saw. The funniest thing. <laughs> Don't listen to Scooter. You did, um, just fine. Oh, and Curtis, you should be proud to play the part of a tree. I should? <laughs> yes. Trees are wonderful things, and they help us in lots of different ways. They do? <laughs> sure. Just follow me, and I'll show you. <laughs> I'll change clothes first. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Curtis. Thanks, Marty. Thanks, Marty. Thanks, Marty. Yeah, I know. Oh, oh, here he is. Feeling better? Definitely. Oh, good. <laughs> then let's all take a look at one of nature's most wonderful creations. <laughs> the tree. <laughs> uh, Barney, I don't think that's a tree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sure it is. You see, it's a... Oh, oh, oh no, you're right. I must have been fooled by the bark. Oh, no. Let's try it again. Here we go. That's more like it. This is a tree, and who knows what we call these things at the bottom? I do. Those are roots. The tree uses its roots to hold it straight and tall, and to drink water from the ground. How does the water get in the ground? Well, Kim, the water comes from the... Gee, and it looks so clear this morning. <laughs> okay, that's enough rain. <laughs> okay. 